All right, what's happening, everybody? It's your boy Akeen. Welcome to today's final blog. Here's to give you one last SEC preview for the 2015 college football season. And for this one, going to wrap things up with the Vanderbilt Commodores. Now, last year, another bad year for this team. I think they went three and nine. They're definitely going to look to improve, but they don't have many stars on both sides of the field. Now, their head coach, Derek Mason, he's entering his second season and he's already struggling. And I think this is is a, a team who definitely desperately need to have a good job recruiting. Now there is one player that I do like on the offensive side. That is running back Ralph on Wells. He's five foot ten, two hundred and two pounds, and he actually led the team with nine hundred and seven yards on. Um, rushing yards and 4.3 yards per carry to go along with four rushing touchdowns for the season. Now, this is a little bit of an issue for this team. Last year, they averaged allowing 33.3 points per game, but only 17.2 points per game on the offensive side. And not really much to say. They, they, they just need a lot of work. They, they, they need everything. I don't really know where to start off with. Even at quarterback, they just, they really, they're going to have to depend on the running back, uh, the defense. But during this offseason, they did pick up a, a quarterback in Kyle Sumner. This is a decent um, um, pickup from from Pennsylvania, even though Johnny McCurry, he, he is entering his sophomore season. Well, I think with a little bit more experience from McCurry, he could be a decent player at quarterback for the Commodores. And they did pick up an outside linebacker in Josh Smith and a number 24 defensive back in Donovan Sheffield. This was a decent pickup as well. Now, they still, like I said, they need stars. They need to find a way to attract players to go to Vanderbilt. And that is going to be a tough task because of all the competition and the SEC conference. Now, overall, I'm being nice right here. And I'm going to give them an 8-4 and four prediction this upcoming season. I think I am being nice. But I do believe that they should get at least one win in the SEC conference. I think they were 0-8 for 8 last season. They need to do a better job this year or unless um, Derek Mason will lose his job immediately. But it's kind of tough to, be built, to even build up this Vanderbilt team. But anything can happen. Now, the next time I'm going to catch you guys will be on Thursday, where I will give you my previews for the Big Ten Conference. I'll see you guys then. Thank you for watching today's vlogs. I'm your man, Keen McCall. Be easy.